In this video, we are going to learn how to create variables that are part of the properties of an object. So right now, I've got four objects open. I've got the cow. I've got the caiman, which is a crocodile. I've got the billy goat. And I've got the scene. These three objects all belong to the scene object. Okay, so we're at scene. Let's work on scene objects now. We're going to scroll down and we're going to add a scene property. So we're going to create a variable that's not part of any method, but it's part of the object. So as long as the scene exists, this variable will exist. Unlike a variable in a method where when the method ends, the variable disappears. So we're going to create a scene property. And I'm going to create a Boolean. So it's going to be have a true or false value. And I'm going to say got cow. So right now you don't have the cow. So it's going to start out at false. So I've got a Boolean got cow and it starts out as false. Now if I wanted to, I could also create another variable that's part of the properties of an object. So I'm going to go to the billy goat. And I'm going to add a billy goat property. And I'm just going to say life. And we're going to make this a whole number variable. And I'm going to initialize this at 5. So this character has a variable called life and it starts out at 5. And I hit OK. And again, this variable permanently belongs to this object. In the same way, the variable got cow permanently belongs to the scene. 